All right, so I know I said we'd wait until the end of the video to talk about this, but I feel like I should just get it out now because most of this video will be me preparing for where I'm going. Um, and it's not gonna really make any sense if I don't just talk about it. So I am going to New Mexico um, for a week uh, because my one of my very best friends, um, his name is Connor, he, um, well first I just want to say that literally we are just friends, Live nothing will ever, ever, ever happen there. Um, we've been homies since day one, and he is actually going into the Air Force, and he's leaving like at the end of the year, but um, he's moving to New Mexico with his dad, and um, I won't... Basically, I won't be able to see him probably ever again until, which sounds so dramatic, but I won't be able to see him until probably, honestly, like high school reunion. And that's so sad because we're so close. Um, but because my family's been social distancing, literally, not social distancing, quarantining since like March um, when the whole um, virus started, um, I haven't seen anybody, really any of my friends since March, which is really sad because I missed, um, like I obviously had a different graduation this year and I wasn't able to go to um, like the end of the year like class parties that the rest of my class did get to go to because their parents aren't like they don't really care no one in my town is really social distancing which is really sad um but besides the point i'm getting off track um connor invited me to go spend the week i'm spending five days um at his dad's house with him and and his family and um as the last like hoorah before um we get to before i don't see him again and Honestly, talking with my mom about this trip, we decided that it would be really good for me because I don't know about you guys, but being, I was so busy before quarantine started and being um, just stuck in the house all the time, not really being able to interact with people other than my family. I love them, but it gets old sometimes, you know. Um, it wasn't good, it's not good for my mental health. And, um, like being inside all the time is not good for my mental health. So we decided that it would be good for me to go on this trip. Now, if you don't know, my aunt is actually high risk. Um, she's pregnant and she's doing a surrogacy for another family. So it's not even her baby. And my cousin, she has epilepsy and so she has seizures. And so when I get back from my five day trip, I will, sorry, my arm is getting tired out. I will be, I've decided that I'm going to quarantine by myself for two weeks just so that I don't um, put my family or my aunt and my cousins at risk. Um, the worst, the I do, I would never, ever, ever want to put my family in a situation where um, they would be in danger or where they would be put at, um, put at risk for the virus. So I will be quarantining for two weeks after I come back from New Mexico um, by myself in actually my sister Destiny's RV, which is really funny. Um, but if you guys wanna see one, like a, like a vlog of me quarantining by myself and what that is like for me, let me know. Um, but you guys will not be seeing me on the vlogs for like two, almost three weeks which is kind of sad um i will miss you guys dearly uh cynthia and i have a lot of videos already planned out um and already edited and stuff so it won't be that hard on her i think she only has to film like a video by herself um anyways but i will miss my family so much and i will miss being on the vlogs um but we are still going to be uploading regular schedule you will even be getting some bonus videos. We've been posting on like Wednesdays usually and Saturdays. Um, but yeah, so today I have to pack and I have to do laundry because I am like, and I leave tomorrow and I am the worst at procrastinating. Um, so I've basically procrastinated this and telling you guys until the last second. So yeah, but anyways I'm actually I'm really excited and I hope you guys will be excited for me too um, of course when in New Mexico where we are going um, there is 
I don't want to say there's n there's no cases there is cases but they're very low and we will obviously be social distancing following all the rules wearing masks using hand sanitizer being super safe not going anywhere where we feel like people aren't being safe um we i just want to have fun with my friends before i don't really get to see them again um you know so anyways i have to do laundry right now so let's go do that Okay guys, so Lacey is gone and I'm super happy but super sad at the same time. I'm sad because I absolutely love Lacey. I'm gonna miss her so much and I'm happy for her because she gets to go have fun with her friends. So while Lacey is gone, I have a few things of my own to do like clean my room, organize my nightstand, you know, just pick up the little things. So I'm gonna take you guys throughout my day. First thing to do is make my bed. Look at this. This is a disaster. Oh my gosh. Since I am all done cleaning my room and organizing everything, I'm going to go shopping for a little. Um, my favorite places are like Sheen, Hollister, American Eagle, or Paxson. I just, I'm obsessed with those um, online stores. Um, so I'm just gonna go shopping for a little. I wanna show you the clothes I'm getting. Okay, um, this is not sponsored by anything. These are just my favorites. Um, okay, let me turn off the light. Okay, the first one is this shirt. Um, Charlie D'Amelio is in the picture, but I'm getting it because that shirt is so cute. It's just like white with the butterfly. And then I'm getting this pair of jeans, which is so cute. I love the rips. And I'm just getting this white plain shirt. And then my last thing I'm getting is these pair of jeans. Yes, Charlie D'Amelio's in it again but I just love those jeans. Shopping is all done. Um, I just ordered everything. I'm super excited, but when they all come in, in like a couple weeks, I'll give you guys a clothing haul. I'm so excited for my new clothes. Okay, so this is Elizabeth, my sister. Um, right now we're gonna go play basketball. <laughs> Half of my family is there. It's one of our favorite things to do is like play basketball as a family. Yep. We're running a little late, so we gotta, we gotta go fast. But one thing I love, I don't know if you guys can see it. Here, let me stop walking real quick. I love that. That is so cute. Um, okay. <laughs> so, um, we got here. They're not here. They're not here at so, all. So, we're really, really late, I'm guessing. So, they're gone. <laughs> Now we're going home. Yeah, well, not we're not going home. We're gonna take a little cruise around our town for a little, and then we'll go home. So we just got home. Our family is home. I don't know if you can see our van, but there it is. I think I definitely missed the party. Yeah. <laughs> It's 11.15 and I'm super tired and I just want to go to bed, so I'm going to get ready for bed. Okay, so I'm all done getting dressed and now I'm going to go brush my teeth. Okay, since I'm all done, I'm gonna take off my makeup and just go to bed. 